Now, many of us feel that school staff members just don't get all the credit they deserve. Among them, school counselors. News Center Maine's Hannah Yashivi shows us how an award-winning counselor works to make sure her students are healthy, safe, and focused on learning. Joey Porter is an eighth grader at Leonard Middle School in Old Town. When he's not in class, you might find him here spending time with school counselor Ms. O'Connell. She helps a lot of kids that have some sort of problems they feel a little unsafe telling anybody else. Always lending students a friendly ear, offering advice and Magic playing music wand. to help calm them down. Had a lot of problems trying to keep myself controlled sometimes and and I've had problems uh, with other kids. That's where Miss O'Connell jumps in. Even though classrooms nowadays look very different, that a lot of those could fall under different categories. Miss O'Connell's presence is always there and has been for the past 18 years. Teach in the classroom. I run small groups. I do friendship groups. I advocate for kids. I run the civil rights team. O'Connell has just been named the first Lifetime Achievement Award winner by the Maine School Counselors Association. They know that they can come to her and there's there's going to be no judgment. O'Connell has noticed that students are more isolated these days, but still her main goal stays the same, supporting the students and helping them be happy. We want to make sure that our kids are all safe like school and can like be the people they want to be. From coping skills to relationships to academic concerns. And always looking out for how can she make that connection with a kid, how can she support them. Students need a lot of support, but many schools don't have enough community resources. We need more therapists, we need more counselors, we have food insecurity, we have social justice concerns. Filling lots of different roles for students. She's one of my favorite people in the school. In Old Town, Hannah Yashivi, New Center, Maine.